is up guys and girls, I am Virtual Pix and welcome back to some Planet Nomads. It's been a little while since I actually last did a recording. I know. You probably guessed as much, but it shh it's fine. I'm back and I'm not going anywhere, I promise. Uh right, so what the bloody hell am I doing? Because this thing pretty much works. So actually, you know what? There is one thing it doesn't have on it. Oh, I know it has the drill. I added that last time, didn't I? Yeah, I forgot to add the drill last time, so I've added the drill this time, and that's now a thing that works. Uh, I don't actually think it needs anything else. Oh, is that too early? Oh, yums. What the hell? Got you over there, and why are you just randomly go? What the hell is producing that light? Oh, the uh, solar beacon, because yeah, the solar beacon really produces a crap ton of light for some reason. Do you know what? I don't actually want to make a move in our new rolling base while it's still dark is it still dark out? it's still dark out right I think no it's still dark out <sighs> morning? morning! or at least good enough it's enough. So, let us go and start this on and, well, let's, let's go and press the start button on it. And I need to pick a direction. Mm, that way. So, probably towards that. I mean, I've already been to that one, but you know, it's fine. I know that that's actually a pretty rough path to follow, so... It'll be a good test as to how... ...mobile this thing actually is. Because... Oh my, is it slow. If it's... ...not mobile, as well as not being fast... ...A's not going to be happy. Also, it's like super fucking wide. So much so that I've actually gotten it stuck on a tree, I think. Good God, what are we stuck on? You know what? Things like this will come in handy anyway. Right. In theory... There we go. And now the other wheels have gotten stuck on it. At the very least, though... Never mind. I was going to say that I could just bump the front wheel back over it, but no, I just completely crushed it instead. Also, why is going that way so difficult for you? What the, what the fuck? Oh, are you serious?
Oh my. Wait, what? What the fuck? What? Uh. Um. Hang, hang on a minute. What? What? Those have settings, but only on one particular face of them. Yes. Anyway, I know how to solve this problem. It's easy. All I've got to do is go... Bob! And then just not take that route, because that route... Is actually too steep for it. And it's all because of that floating part. That floating part in the middle is the only thing which actually enables it to travel over water. Is the very thing that might actually cripple this thing. Good God, as well as how fucking wide it is. I thought I had plenty of clearance on that, but apparently no, I did not. I, I I don't want to be going this way, game. Why are you making me go this way? Stop it. There we go. <sighs> Much better. Right. I can still foresee that little cushiony thing being a problem. I mean, it's bad enough that I am... Wide as a bus is an understatement. I am about as wide as two fucking buses at this point. Also, are we actually... No, we've already discovered that bit, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, good God. In order to actually even do anything with that radar, I need to venture beyond this thing that I'm travelling towards. Um, okay, don't know what the sudden steering that way was. Um, hi. Oh. Trees, right, gotcha. Don't mind me, just gonna... Hopefully plow on through. I do want to give it to this thing. It can take out trees pretty effectively. Like, a lot more effectively than I would have thought. Uh, no. No. Come on. Oh, you're just... You're not going to make it up that, are you? Ah. And now, because I've got... Nowhere to go forward and nowhere to go backwards. Right, so I actually need to get out. Yeah, yeah, whatever, shut up. Right, it's 
on down. Uh, okay, the, what in God's name is going on? What the fuck? Ready. Oh god. Wait, what the fuck? Physical condition critical. Body failure imminent. Right, okie dokie. Uh, okay, okay. Physical condition critical. Body failure imminent. Okay, there we go. Okay. Note to self. This gun is actually shit. What the fuck? And what's worse is that I need to try and figure out a way to, um... I actually need to take that off. I need to take the one up there off. Aha! And now I can move. Or apparently I cannot. Why can I not move? Why is that such... Why is that hill such a huge fucking problem for me? Ah, there we go. It's because I need a little bit of movement. Right, you guys are going to fucking get it. That's it. Take my will. And be perfectly fine from it. Um... I beg your pardon. What? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? What did I get stuck on? I got stuck on something. I just don't know what. And I now actually can't get out. Because if I get out now, I am pretty much dead. Oh, I got stuck on that. Okay, that's fine. Let's go this way, shall we? Yeah, I'm... Not a hundred percent happy, happy with this thing. Quite work the way I intended it to. Oh god. Okay. Okay, let's. Do you know what? I think. I definitely need to go back to the drawing board for this thing because it is slow, it is wide, it is affected by just about fucking everything on the planet, and its ability to actually travel anywhere is abysmally poor. This thing should be able to rule the world. I mean, look at it. It's fucking huge. It should be able to roll over anything in one foul swoop. Does it? No. Why? Fuck loads. He just doesn't like me. Oh, please tell me we're gonna be small enough to actually fit through all of this. Ah. Uh, that's it's not really a problem because I know exactly what I'm gonna do anyway. I'm still going to do the exact thing that I was going to do, which is go and look for the main alien monument. What have we got stuck on? 
Whenever it does that weird tiny thing. Okay, right. Okay, so I need to plow through these trees. Dead on. There we go. And then I need to back up. And then just pretty much charge them. Get the fuck out of my way! You are in my way, and I don't much appreciate it. Actually, you know what? I can probably just go around them. There we go. Because if they get caught up on my wheels, that's not a problem. Because they'll just... The wheels will crush them, like, instantly. Because for some reason, the wheels have more crushing power than the front of my vehicle. Don't question it. I don't. I've learned that questioning certain things in this game is um, not good for your health. Like, more importantly, where in God's name is my freaking base? Oh, fuck's sake. What have I got caught on this time? Seriously? I'm fucking miles away from that. How did I get caught on it? <sighs> okay, it's a note to self. I definitely need to make sure that whenever I do make one of these things, in fact, I might actually have to tear this part thing apart and start again. Because it's literally too fucking wide. There we go. It just gets caught up on everything. Oh dear god. This isn't going to go well because it's sliding down the hill sideways as well as going forward at the same time. Okay, so yes, this thing has about as much fucking use as a soggy piece of toast. Well, you were a big old waste of resources, weren't you? Get out of it. I am going to tear you apart at some point and convert you into something else. I have no idea what. But it'll be something. I don't need any of that. What I do want is that. Can I not take that one out? No. Okay, fair enough. What I can do, though, is use the little buggy, which, um... is actually good. That's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Right, so I need to drop all of this in there. Apparently I already had stuff in there, fair enough. Lovely. And also try and work out whether or not. Huh, I wonder. Eventually, when this menu pops up. Hey, there we go. Don't know why that took so long. Did. Right, so yeah. 
the things that I'm doing, what are they? No, I don't want conveyor connector. I want one of those. Actually, no, I do want the conveyor connector. Right. You come here. Um, I think I'm about close enough. I should be able to reach in the, uh, will be in reach of the thing. So, let's see. What do you mean I've not got enough resources? Are you telling me the one thing that I don't actually fucking have is basic frames? You fucking what? If I don't have them, fuck build them for me, you bastard! Jeez. Ah, oh, right. And that one, and then. This one, that side. There we go. No, it's the best of both worlds. Not that I actually give a fine monkeys, because the only thing I actually wanted to do. Thank you was put a single block there so that I can take this oh my I can actually cover that and put that on Absolutely fucking ridiculous. <laughs> but you know what? I actually kind of have to see now. I forget that the um, main switchboard is in here. I really need to put that switchboard in a better place. Uh, so I want set up. And I want to connect, and I want to connect you to that. And then I want to get rid of that. Nine hours and 43 minutes. And now we've also got that thing attached to us. So... Do you know, I should probably go and check that with that thing attached, this thing even still floats. Because I'm going to guess that's probably added quite a significant amount of weight to the back. No, I didn't bother checking the center of gravity or anything. So. Alas, over to the water. Let's go and throw ourselves in it see if this thing still works. I mean, it's still faster than the bloody mobile base. Like, miles faster. It's about double the speed, actually. Boop! Get me through! And somehow, amazingly, it still seems to float on water, even with that huge fucking satellite dish jammed off its ass. it still works what how is this tiny little buggy well not really tiny but you know what I mean how is this buggy the, the very thing that I, create, that I created to just kind of roam around not only faster more, more effective but just generally better at its job 
than the huge big ass thing that I spent three fucking videos building and designing and then this thing just outperforms it in every way, shape and form. It's smaller, it's nowhere near as wide. It, I mean, it is quite wide considering, but it's nowhere near as wide as the mobile base thing. It's faster, it seems to be apparently more agile, it's way, way more versatile on um, what land it can go through. And now it has a satellite dish on its ass which is basically the only thing it was missing. Oh, didn't see that resource block there. I mean, look, the mobile base has literally left a trail of destruction along its path. This thing, the best it's done is murder a few things. Boop 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 boo coming through Don't mind me Beep beep <laughs> Anyway I need to be going and actually searching don't I so I did not mean to be doing that Bonk Don't mind me as I just kind of steer around you now. There we go. Right, so that's one alien monument, but that's not the main alien monument. So I need to be going. Uh, pretty much uh, that way. Yeah, west seems like a good way to go. And then we can start actually, you know, uncovering more of the planet. I mean, I'm not sure how this is going to work with one of these attached to, like, the back of a vehicle. Okay, game. Thank you for saving when I really needed this steering at that point, but I guess... Coming through! through, don't mind me, I need to go around that big grouping of trees because I don't really feel like driving through that. And then head a little bit south, and then pretty much all the way west. Lovely. This thing's so much more effective than the uh, world roller. I don't even know what. I'm starting to wonder why the fuck I even bothered to build that thing. This thing just—it's better. It works. It does its job, and no nothing more, nothing less. It does exactly what I ask it to do. Kind of like Pippi. It's like Pippi, but with wheels. Well, actually, it's like, like Pippi when she had wheels. And when Pippi was actually tiny, which is the reason why she was called Pippi. Because you know Pip as in Pip Squeak. Anyway, moving on. Since when did I uncover that area? I don't remember doing that. And also, we're actually almost out of range for this, so... Soon? The fuck did I hit? Not a clue. Right. Okay, let's... Let's let it do a thing.
Hey, there we go. Look at that, there's a big old bit of water. Actually, that water connects all to the... Wow. There is a lot of water on this planet. I am, however, going to head towards that because that looks like it'll be great fun to drive over. Because, you know, what could possibly go fucking wrong? It's not like I've ever had problems with uh, water in the past. No. Don't know what you're talking about. Before I go into the water, though, I do need to make sure that I've got enough power to do so. Why is driving... What the fuck? Why are these trees so symmetrical? Quick, down the hill! Oh, oh god, oh god, what the fuck did I hit? Oh, I didn't hit anything, it just decided to grow a tree out of my fucking arse. Well, thank you game, as much as I appreciate that, I kind of don't at the same time. Now, how much power have I got? Eight hours, 36. Also, why does that tree have, like, fruit in it? Extreme temperature warning. Well, okay then. I don't know what I was expecting, but apparently nothing is what I shall get. Right now, this now this should actually get really deep, really fast because of where it's leading to. doesn't even give a shit. Straight, no shit's given. We're just floating across the ocean like it's not even a thing. And how far have I got to go? Pretty much all the way off. So I can pretty much take the water all the way. It should. Yeah, basically... Pretty much where those trees over on this side have just rendered it right in the very far distance. Yeah, because I know for a fact, in fact, you know what, I'm actually going to just double check that because... Just because I got out of the car does not mean that my car has to sink faster than the fucking brick. You know, the hover engines are still active even without me in them. The only thing I can think is just the very fact that I was even... What in... Whoa... Yes, because graphics, you know, those, those things that we use um, to do things, but that's, I actually need to get to dry land and then um, hopefully soon, because we're running out of time. Basically, I'm running out of time for recording. 
it's already like super late and like I should have done this recording hours ago but me being me I overslept which has pretty much been the story lately like it's not even that I haven't been recording for the sake of not recording I've just been not recording because sleeping way too long and having way too much to do on that day and then not having enough time to actually physically record render or edit and then render so we just didn't do it yeah moving on eventually we will get to that fucking island over there I hope I can drive up onto it because Actually, it looks like there's kind of a bank over this side I might be able to go on to. I could even go onto that one actually by the looks of it. Hell, most of that hill, I could, this thing could probably drive over, with exception to that bit there, because that's basically a sheer fucking drop. Although, I don't know. This buggy has impressed me in the past with the, uh, how vertical it can actually get. See? Like, the, most vehicles would be having immense amounts of trouble, if not even actually incapable of passing over that. My little buggy? couldn't give more than two shits about it. It literally doesn't care. Why have we frozen? Ah, apparently map was updated. So I think it's literally just his length that gives it that advantage. The fact that it's so goddamn long, a whole Shit, that is a lot of water. That is a lot of water. What am I going over? The this planet's equivalent of the Pacific fucking ocean. Well then. No, stop rolling backwards. I, d I said stop rolling backwards. Right, okay, you know what? Excuse me while I um, navigate my buggy into a position where it's not going to start rolling away on me. Why? I think we're good. Right, so, now that I know we're good, that does it for this video. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button and stay awesome as always. And I'll see you lot in the next video, which will actually be when it's supposed to be.